Um, traditionally, most organizations adopt uh, the balance scorecard method to measure operating performance. Most organizations today are challenged to take a 360 degree view of performance by concentrating on reporting, reviewing, and acting upon a limited number of KPI, which impact most on, uh, on organizational performance. Based on the textbook, we learn we know that the balance scorecard have long been used in a strategic business management to track key performance from four perspectives: financial, customer, uh, internal process, and uh, the learning and the growth or innovation perspective. So, from the research, we know that implementing a Balance metric system is an uh, evolutionary process, not a one-time task that can be quickly checked off as completed. If you do not recognize this from the beginning and fail to commit uh, to a long term, then the organization will realize a disappointed result. So there are something need to be awarded if the company need, wants to use the ba uh, balance scorecard. The first one is that uh, they should let employees know it's not just boss wants it. Boss does need it, but it also could be considered as an achievement for employees during the, this half year or the whole year. It can demonstrate employees working effort clearly and straightforward without needing employees to explain to their boss too much. It's better to let employees know the balance scorecard result could help them to get promotion, uh, to get promoted in the future, let people have the self-motivation. The second thing is that uh, it's necessary to explain to companies' employees that why would need to use this balance scorecard. Let employees know better how this balance scorecard would help them to do their job. So people can consider a good balance scorecard for each person in the company as the right direction for their long-term working in this company. Uh, it's important to let people understand that they can get benefit from this KPI system. If they don't know why, employees will become outwardly committed workers which means that there's no self-motivation from inside and their output, their productivity will go down. So it's really important to let them understand reason and uh, let them feel that they can get benefit from it. The last thing is, the last thing is for companies that, that um, the scorecard work better when they are revealed frequently enough to make a difference. For example, if a metric value changes on a daily basis, and the variables within our control of management can be affected on a daily basis, then the metric should be revealed on a daily basis. Additionally, uh, metrics reveal meetings should, be f uh, should follow a standard agenda with clearly defined roles for all attendance and an expectation that follow through on any agreed upon actions will be monitored at all uh, at each meeting. So uh, that'll be all the key issue I think will effect uh, uh, consider in effective implementing a balanced scorecard. Uh, thank you.